Good everyone, welcome to Jotitos. So this is the second video in our series and the last video, the first video, which is the Uvena array. So what do we do? We did our lettering configuration. So we're going to do for the second array, which is our Slumberger array configuration. We're going to prove for the geometric factor. Okay, so just sit still and watch everything step by step. Good. Uh, so as I said earlier, the formula for geometric factor is not going to change, which is G is equal to 2 pi over what? 1 over R1 minus what? 1 over R2 minus 1 over R3 plus 1 over what? R4. Good. Yeah. So what do you need to know? You need to know your R1. So from here, now the Slumberger array, the thing that we use there is that what? From the midpoint between the P1 and P2, can you see? From the midpoint and P1 and P2, there are some uh, measurements that we use, okay? So unlike the uh, the venary where we have equal spacing between electrodes, this one is different. So here we have between P1 and the midpoint, okay? So P1 and the midpoint is small letter L, P2, so from the midpoint to any of the potential is small letter L. Why from the midpoint to the current, any of the current electrode, it is big letter L. Good. So for R1, what does R1 is? It is distance from what? So I'm just reiterating again. Distance from C1 to what? To P1. Okay? So if, can you see? This is C1 to P1. If C1 to the middle is what? This OL. Okay? And so C1 to this P will mean that what? You remove this small letter L from the big L. Okay? So that's what? L1 minus what? Let me write two here. C1 to P1 is what? L1 minus what? L1. L1 minus L minus small letter L. That's R1. R2. Okay, so what's our R2? Our R2 is what? What I say is it? C2 to what? To P1. Okay? So C2 to this midpoint is L, but we have not reached P1. So we need to, for us to reach P1, we have to add this L to it. So big L plus what? Small L. So that's C2 to P1 is good so for r3 r3 is what from what c1 to what to p2 you can see from c1 to the midpoint is what l so but we have not reached p2 what do we need to reach p2 plus under l so which means from c1 to p2 is what big l plus what small l okay so for r4 r4 is what from c2 to p2 C2 to the middle is more than the distance from what? C2 to P2. So what can we do? We need to remove what? This small letter L. If we can remove small letter L from this big L, we will be able to get the distance from what? C2 to what? To P2. Can you see? Okay. So C2 to P2 is what? L, capital letter L minus small letter L. Good. Now we have our values. So we can substitute everything inside our what? geometric equation. Let's start. So g is equal to 2 pi over 1 over what? Capital L minus small letter L minus 1 over capital L plus small letter L minus 1 over capital L plus what? Small letter L plus 1 over capital L minus what? Small letter L. The next thing we're going to do is what? LCM, okay? So the LCM of these fractions on that it is just L plus what? L, small letter L, and what? Capital L minus small letter L. Good. Okay, L minus L in this, what do we have? We have L plus what? L. So we write times one. So L plus L minus, enter you have minus proof of brackets, just be guided. So this in this, you have what? L minus L times one. So Minus L minus what? Small letter L. Okay? And we have minus again. Put your bracket also. Don't forget. Put your bracket before you start. Okay? So this guy in this, what you miss? This, right? We have L minus what? Small letter L. And the last one is plus. Then to bother putting your bracket. So this guy in this, you have what? L plus what? Small letter what? L. Okay, so 
let's say we have 2 pi all over what? L plus what? L minus capital L plus small letter L minus capital L plus small letter L plus capital L plus small letter L over okay over what l plus what small letter l capital l minus small letter l okay there's not an add just need to follow it bit by bit so two pi over what now we have l minus l that's zero we're doing for the capital letter first l minus l is zero right minus l so this guy because this guy minus l plus l is also what zero so we have plus small l plus under small l that's what two small l plus under small l three small l plus under small l four small l okay so if you look at what is here you can see that so it's different of two squares if you do l so different of two square just turn different of two square so you are saying what l square minus what small l what square okay good now what do we do okay why do we change the final phase 2 pi divided by what 4 small l over what capital l square minus small l square is equals to 2 pi times what l square minus small l square over 4 small l okay so this will now give us pi own bracket what l square minus small l square over what two small l two year one two year two that's how we got this two l okay so therefore this is your geometric factor for slumberger array okay that's your geometric factor for slumberger array thank you very much please make sure you subscribe to the channel